know of it. The whole thing about One Punch Man is he's just like, oh man. It's making it's 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 like, I punch it's too self, hard. It's so. a, you know, it's satirical. So it's it sounds very you know I like it, but I don't know if this is what mood you're trying to set. Uh, I can't hear any music. Andy, reload. Let's see. Uh, reload. But uh, we were last time. Uh, we were we were on the boat to to scar. Uh, I I guess I could. Yeah, <laughs> we're replacing one idiot with another British idiot because anybody who knows me at this point should know that nobody can tell the difference between my character voice and my regular voice. So, that's why, because nobody can discer discern which one's which, so I have to make the difference myself. Why are all Jane? my characters cat folk? It's your fault, mostly. <laughs> because you're the one who's... No, it's your fault, mostly, because you're the one who never was able to discern which... If I was speaking in character or out of character. And I can't, for the life of me, remember to say out of character. So they're all British now. Heck you. I think it's a useful device. It is. It is very useful. And it's because the only accent that I can actually do right. But yeah, I just... <laughs> I don't try, because I... Oh, God. <laughs> it is pretty terrible. <laughs> yeah, I think you'll enjoy the voice I got lined up then. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> But uh, by the by, I won't need Rezo's character sheet, right? <laughs> if naval gamma happens, uh, they deal with it, and we just sort of, you know, clap. <laughs> For the first time in how many months we've been on that stupid island? Pfft, yeah. Uh -huh. Oh no. They found the idiot. <laughs> they found the stupid idiot, man. <laughs> they found the big dumb. Huh? They found the big dumb. They did find the big dumb. <laughs> He's a mess. Which, of course, she would take up the opportunity for. Definitely. Walter is going to grab Rachel's head and uh, clap her on the shoulder. It's been a pleasure making your acquaintance. If, you <laughs> ever, if you're ever around Era Stockades, don't go. You will not like it there. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this would also, it also, you know, fairness, I'd love to welcome you, but you would be terrified. I've seen a lot. I hope we'll pass across again one day. Same. But far from Aristocrat. It's... It, it, it was lovely to meet you two. All of you. Hey, next person we run into, I'll stab him in the kidneys for you. <laughs> you. You don't have to do that. <laughs> oh, no, no, I insist. I think it would well, be more more suiting to honor her with exactly the weapon being you. in their face. <laughs> you know what, actually, yeah, I'm just... I'm gonna grab a pie from the next market and just smack it in their face for you. 
That would be rather amusing. <laughs> How much would a pie cost? Uh, a couple stolen. Banana cream. Banana cream, of course. The only pie that is proper for face, face smacking. Yeah, Lovely. Yeah, yeah, history, especially the pecan pie, it's like, oh. Yeah, that's that's just like dangerous. hitting somebody with a brick. <laughs> okay, so thanks for giving me another idea for the chef. <laughs> Can't fruit pie bludgeoning. <laughs> the, the, the clobbering cobbler. <laughs> Another time. Another time. Yes. Yeah, he's watching. He's chilling. He's right there. Hi, Dust Brother. <laughs> she would wave down to them she as she's she, going. She injured on a Pegasus. <laughs> yeah. It is. Sure is. <laughs> Why is there a giant crab waving at us way in the back? <laughs> I heard legends He came crab. up to the surface to see us. <laughs> <laughs> I heard legends of that crab. <laughs> Never thought these I'd see the, myself. These are the moments that I love right here where it's just like the funniest things become legend in the party. <laughs> they say he was tamed by a fiery cat first. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, what were you saying? Oh boy. Oh no. You said I didn't need Rezo's sheet. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Look out for dolphins. <laughs> Wouldn't he go after Saki though? Because he's a cat? Crab friend doesn't have great eyesight. <laughs> or... <laughs> okay, fair. Mm -hmm. Okay, fair. Okay. <laughs> right. 18 reflex. The legends are true, Mother of his kitty. <laughs> Thank you. He says questioningly. There's the Russians. <laughs> You can't eat dolphins. Dolphins are intelligent. Not this one. This Spend one. all his money on cheap lottery tickets. Lovely. You are friends with a giant crab. <laughs> Rezo just shrugs. He isn't going to question it.
Oh, oh God. no. Is he going to be steal st uh, staying with the party now? Okay, thank God, because if he did that, then he would be in trouble. <sighs> Yes. It took me a second, but I know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. So all my feats are now in. And now I can actually focus more. As the journey progresses, more of them going to be a little bit more trouble this time goes on. You, uh, you okay there? I was expecting a message from somebody, but I haven't heard, so. So, that's bad. I have questions. That's questions that can't be answered. So, I'm just going to have to live with that discomfort. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, you want Rezo too? I... Sheriff Maltham's like, hey, do you know this? Do I know this? With, uh... <laughs> okay, that's, uh... Wow, I rolled a 3 and that's still an 18. Why the hell did I get kicked out of the game? Well, the roll of 18. And sorry, I'll be right back. I need to use the bathroom. Sure. Anything with a fifteen or eighteen? Okay. Yeah. <laughs>
happened there? Hmm. Just the wind? I don't think it was the wind. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty windy earlier for us, too. <laughs> In a basement? Oh! Uh, not in the inside, right? Okay, so I'd say I. He's living in a tent or a gazebo. Oh no! Oh no! Don't get me started on the gazebos. Oh no! <laughs> At least it's out of the wind. <laughs> Yeah, that's not fun. <laughs> I was driving down the road once and I could feel like I had to drive against the wind a bit because it was causing me to pull a bit. Oh no. It, you know, I live over the mountains, so it's not unheard of, but it was just like, oh, huh. It was just a little bit more aggressive than you were thinking. Yeah, it was like, it basically felt like you, I just need to get my alignment check. Oh. Oh, here comes- oh. Ugh, I hate that. One big old gust of wind come just came by, and the one thing that I hate most about this place is the fact there, that we have three trees in the backyard. And one of them likes to sway more than the others. Ooh. And it freaks me out. I don't like it. Please. Please stop swaying. I can see the like the bottom of it sway more. I don't like it. <laughs> no. Well, trees are supposed to sway, so I wouldn't worry too much. I I know, but it's just like it sways a lot more than the other two. Like I can watch. I can like move my eyes down the tree, and see more of the bottom of it swaying than the other two. Yeah. Okay. I don't like it. It's not a I'm fun sure. thing to look at. I have to remember what this track is. It's very appropriate for a lot of things. Oh. Okay. That's why I stopped the roll corner thing. Huh. Yeah. I... Yeah, I try not to. Use it again. Well, that's the reason it's royalty free. <laughs> Heck yeah. And there's a lot of people who make some really neat stuff that's like, that's royalty free? What? <laughs> it's surprising sometimes. It's kind of weird how the, the term royalty free is like, you know, it's not like, there's no kings or queens here, baby. It's just, <laughs> yeah. It is kind of funny. It's also funny that Rule Britannia is actually royalty free. <laughs> Despite it having very strong associations with the royal family. <laughs> Maybe that was the joke. Maybe that's what they were trying to do. Maybe. <laughs> I don't it know could, it could be. Could be the whole point. Just to make it, haha, it's funny, isn't it? I don't know where that t term came from. So maybe it has something to do with I'm sure probably if you go back far enough, it does have something to do with the bar. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Me neither. That's one of those weird things that I would put into a list of like, here's something to do for your college research paper. One of those weird things that nobody thinks about. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have a several of those. Essay and then some guy steals for clickbait. Yeah, but it's just like, I, I just have had several ideas of like, if somebody was doing like, an essay or trying to do an essay for college and they couldn't think of anything, these stupid things would be really fun to do a paper on. 
Like, one of the ones that I had was, like, who, or, like, why was somebody eating moldy cheese? How did they figure out that it was actually good? I know that one. Desperation. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but it's just, like, it's one of those things that you could just think about it. You could research it because it's just like, huh, why did that happen? It's stupid, but I like that. And honestly, it would be good for them. Reserve in Cave, West Virginia. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Uh, I don't know what the, why they feel they need to hoard cheese, but it's like Canada with their maple syrup. There's apparently a supply big enough in Canada to supply the entire world with maple syrup. They have a hoard. I don't know why they need that. Well, yeah, but it's just like it's a thing that they have an entire <laughs> stash of maple syrup to supply the world if it runs out. They're always there. <laughs> okay, sorry about that. I'm back. Hello. We we were having a discussion. What cursed oh, video? No. Oh, I like that one. Me. That's funny. Not me. That That's just me. Oh my god! The moose comes! <laughs> okay, what did I miss? I was, I was giving a funny story about how I wanted to make a list of stupid things that people could do college essays on. And I, I got to the point of talking about how like, one of them is the factor of when, why did somebody eat moldy cheese and figure out it was good? And then we got on a maple syrup because it was like, I, I know that there, uh, it's a Let's thing. Let's drink the blood of tree. It's, it's, the th it's a thing with Canada that they have an entire reserve of maple syrup to basically give to the entire world if it runs out. I, I, I just did a quick bit of reading. It's not the world. It it's actually for their own industry of, of like, to, because a lot of people are employed by that. Lovely. <laughs> yeah, like, who thought to, just, like, boil water, put hops and barley into it, let it rot, and then drink it? Yeah, pretty much. It's those Egypt. kinds of things. <laughs> Egyptians? Honestly, they, yeah. They, 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 they're the people that first discovered beer, so. There you go. Are they? I would have thought they discovered me. Oh no! Who's Taya and why? It's... Oh, right. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, I wasn't even trying to break him. It just happened. Oh boy. Anyway, so Knowledge Arcana, 18. <laughs> yeah, Rezo yes. also got an 18. Love that. Lovely. And that's helpful for vampires, but a lot of other monsters are like that are obligate nocturnal are also kept away by the sun. I wonder if they've brought it to them. Because a lot of those monsters, you know, they're not people you could reason with, they're animals. <laughs> that is what the blood god exists for. Or fungus even, like, you know, it's an ooze. There's literally no reasoning with an ooze, you just deal with it or else. <laughs> <laughs> or else. Make a pleasant soup. <laughs> we don't talk yeah, about that. We don't talk like about that bowl. one. Don't bring it up. We don't talk about that one either. I was just thinking of like black molds them. and slime. No! 
baloney ooze. Let's go. Ah. Uh, why? It's it's just it, it comes out of beat flag abilities. Yeah, why don't we go straight to the castle, get our bearings first? I don't really need to do shopping, so... Um, but I am glad to be back on land. Immediately falls over. <laughs> Kisses the ground. <laughs> Probably. I my land legs. <laughs> Reza oh, no. does? Botham does not, I think. Nope, oh, you Reza. wouldn't need Reza's character sheet. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Listen. Too busy enjoying dirt. Too busy enjoying dirt. Are you playing in That's the a dirt 25 for room? Reza. She's a dwarf. What do you expect? <laughs> Ah, the call of my people. <laughs> mhm. Mm Yeah, Mothra is. She got her sea legs, but the transition is a bit rough. Mm. She's not a. Uh, she's not very nautical. She's trying. That's all. Many all arrow the ones in. War. Yeah, I was just about literally to say, all the ones in arrow stockades. What? Where is our other campaign? <laughs> literally. M Mothra just didn't go out much, so. Yeah. Understandable. Yeah, it's now like we came in and killed their queen or any- Oh, crap, that's exactly what we did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, the vampires kinda conquered Diskyarn. Oh. Yeah, I can see why that might be some tension. That's not very much time. People have memories. Uh. Is it what sort of castle? Is it like Romanesque, Gothic, what? So Norman. Okay. It's not built on a swamp, is it? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. We don't I talk said about I was that. To build my castle on a swamp. <laughs> it's like swamp. I actually just watched that recently, and that's why it clicked so fast. <laughs> Ugh. Oh. 
Oh, oh no. Unfortunate. I guess you imagine. must suffer then. To detect magic. I do it. Squinting. <laughs> Squints. <laughs> Yeah, Saki immediately looks nervous. <laughs> Technically, we're all sort of animated on positive energy, aren't we? I, I've kind of slept through that lesson. Oh. Gotcha. Yeah, so, not good stuff. Particularly anti-vampire weapons. Although, you know, somebody brings some garlic oil and they'll probably be, you know, just sniffed out. What? I'm Italian. I'm just like, ew. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know the thing. I, is, that, is that racist? I'm sorry if that's racist. Well, Oh. Which is strange. It does not hurt us. It simply is unpleasant. Oh, I don't like onions, so. <laughs> They're well, all right. it's, just, it's for flavor, but I don't like the Well, do onions make you irrationally recoil? No, but uh, overboiled mushrooms do. Just can't handle it. It's like it's like it's like rotten mush. Ugh. You gotta be. Oh crap! And Rachel. Natalie, <laughs> please tell me she left that before us. Yeah, I'm gonna retcon that one and say she left it behind. She didn't. She doesn't really need it because you know if if they found the idiot. And she works with vampires in her home. There is literally no use. <laughs> Not Mothram. <laughs> Mothram has her like Mothram has a net guard. That's it. Oh no. Yeah, Rezo can't carry it. Rachel doesn't trust Mothram with it because of the way that she acted when we when we got it. Mm. Either Brig or Saki. Wait, what, 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 what? No, I... Oh, wait, yeah, I do. He pulls out the Vampire Be Gone necklace. What's the matter with the sword? Oh, yeah. The sword is no more evil than the wielder. So, uh, you guys are gonna want these things, aren't you? Yeah, that's fair. He hands them over without a fuss. Just as long as people get their things back. That's the important bit. Good! They're like Mr. Dottle. Not rude. <laughs> Okay, oh, where, where are we going for, for processing? Wow. 
Why not? Your country, okay. Uh, your country. I'm not going to tell you anywhere in your country. Just, I'm a little surprised. <laughs> Certainly. It's I'd like a bed that doesn't rock. And if anybody makes a pun, I will slap. <laughs> I'ma think it. I'll think about slapping. Thank you kindly. I suppose my old room. Perhaps it will jog memories. You have posters. <laughs> Toys? I'm curious. Maybe? Oh yeah, you wouldn't know. I'm sad. <laughs> yeah, I'll let you. I'll let you go handle your memories. You think that's sad? He's hanging out with his girlfriend. He can't remember. Oh. That's at least Mother at least has already grappled with that, but it's more of just be like coming home to a place you have no recollection of, but it like should have a meaning to you. That just that just strikes her as sad. Yeah, it really is, isn't it? It just sucks, bro. That's all. <laughs> you know, why don't we just do Rezo in a off camera. Walter is going to sweep her room thoroughly. Not literally. Or like bug sensor. Mm -hmm. Not literally, but thoroughly. She's not gonna do a broom, please. Here we go, tidying up. No, but like, you know, stone cunning everything. <laughs> uh, detect magic everything. Just make sure it's not bugged. Or there's no secret passages, or et cetera, et cetera. Well, it's not bugged, but there is a bug. Oh my God. Several bugs, actually. <laughs> Just kind of skittering across the floor. They can stay. <laughs> the bugs can stay. They're baby. <laughs> You're yeah, welcome. I actually don't mind spiders in the house, because, you know, ants, crap like that, they eat my food. Spiders eat the things that eat my food. Yes. As long as it's not a dangerous spider or something, like, super tiny, I'm fine. I do not like tiny spiders. Ah, uh, yeah. I don't yeah. like tiny spiders one bit, and brown recluses are also very sucky. Yeah, they, uh... They're dangerous. They are very dangerous. Just make, it, make sure you have a doctor friend on call to tell you what to do, because that's what happened with my dad. <laughs> oh, did he break out in a rash? Uh, uh he got, like, a little anything? bite. He got a little bite. And his doctor friend was just like, oh, use this. Yeah, because the nightmarish pictures you see on the internet are just people who are horribly allergic to it. 
Yeah. Yeah, his was just a little tiny. His was just like a little tiny bite that kind of got Northern gross. <laughs> oh, sorry, we're getting off track. We're just complaining about spiders. <laughs> Okay, Love so that. there's no paintings with the eye, all the eyes cut out, right? Surprising <laughs> enough. It's just... Squints. Well, okay. Uh, first, I'm going to need a different room, but where is this? You know, I'm just going to go. Oh. Okay. Oh, 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 that's that's nice. All right. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, ah, it very makes sense considering the history. Uh, how big is the room? Do I have a roommate? A roommate. A roommate. It is quite large. <laughs> oh, baby. I'm not going to get to sleep for a good hour then. Okay. <laughs> no sleep for Mothram, only play. Yay! Woo! So happy. What a happy, cute couple they are. <laughs> right. Monitor. Not entirely ass backwards. Is this what parents are supposed to be like? Anyway. Uh, Martha was gonna. Right, just start for taking some notes and uh, keep a journal of the events. All this is gonna decipher it. Lovely, of course. Nah. Is Urus just a cat in disguise? Because that's just how cats are. Kinda. Yeah, but I'm Ball saying. Day, please. Not huh? in court. Not in <laughs> Yeah, just down. <laughs> or just grab him by the scruff. That'll deactivate him. <laughs> didn't have much of a scruff. He does a neck, and I don't grab him by the neck, he might snap it. Oh. You see the consognathus neck? They're... Yeah, they're kind of weedy.
At least for everybody but Mothram. <laughs> it wasn't the room quality, it was the company. Yeah. Just grab the Urist, put him in bed with you, and hold. There. He has claws. I guess so do cats! Oh, uh, guys, hang on one sec. Yeah? Yeah, my, uh, grocery delivery's here. Heck yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, let's not do that. That's bad. Oof. That was a noise. Oh. Uh, you just take them off for like two seconds. God damn it. <laughs> it sounded like you said white sugar, and I'm just like, what? I've had kettle corn, but I don't I acknowledge it guys, exists. But, okay, so I was uh, hanging with my friend uh, Brandon, and we were uh, flying something. I don't remember what, but I was hungry for snacks. Of course. And, uh, but he had this big tin of uh, terrible corn popcorn, and I just grabbed a handful of it, and I ate like, this tastes funny. He looked at me like, you don't, like, you know that like, he, I don't really think what he said. Anybody like Did that tastes funny? That's because I sprayed with rain. That's ant poison. So then I just, oh my god! So then I ran outside and uh, made myself throw up. Call the poison control, my god! And then the next year for my birthday, he got me a ten of, of uh, caramel corn popcorn and, and a bottle of rain. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you make jokes with your friends right there. Fantastic. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Those kind of things he's, are he's, funniest. He's, he is my oldest friend I've noticed since kindergarten, so we have fun. Lovely. I don't. It, uh, yeah, I'll be honest. I'm kind of anomalous with that. Most people don't. But, yeah. Uh, I, I just got lucky. <laughs> I'll be honest. Because, I mean, you know, make friends in kindergarten. I like red. I like red, too. We're friends now. That's and just we me. just happen to, you know, develop along the same lines that are, we have, and even as adults, we have similar shared interests. So, you know, most yeah. people don't, aren't that lucky. But yeah, I that's the thing with me is most of the time if I'm making friends, it's because we have shared interests. Yeah. And that's like the only reason most of the time. Well, that's 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 why yeah, that's how friends are made. And I was yeah. lucky in that, you know, the person who I have I made a friend with in kindergarten. And I guess we sort of, we really did influence each other because like you know, he introduced me to Star Wars when I was in like first grade. And I was like, oh yes, this is amazing. <laughs> so you know, we you know. We help shape each other that way, I guess. Love that. Uh, coffee. <laughs> coffee. Coffee. Important. We didn't get sleep. <laughs> As long as it's not acorn coffee, she's happy. And I'm pretty sure they don't even have acorn coffee. That's that's the thing down there. If yeah. they bring it up here, burn it. If, anyway, uh, you probably... Uh, before she heads out, uh, she's going to make sure she's at her best that she is still thinking of herself as a representative of Aristocate at this court. Make sure Urus has his little tabard on. Oh. Uh, I don't think she actually has press visitation, so she just does the old-fashioned way with soap and water. I'm not sure. 
Let me double check. Yeah, but I don't think uh, you, even if you uh, even if I have it know it, I don't it I have to prepare. <laughs> oh my god. No, we just don't have press visitation. At all. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I'm losing no, it right she just now. Old fashioned way with soap and water. <laughs> uh. no, she, she, <laughs> That's her morning. Hmm. Well, while it's dry, well, while the tabard is drying, uh, she'll pick that up, slice it open with a dagger, and uh, read. My friend's playing one of their first Animal Crossing games ever, and they just oh, got stung. They they just got stung by wasps and is screaming at us, Take my villager from me, I am not worthy. <laughs> I am a bad mom. It, it's not the first time it's gonna happen, it won't be the last. I know. <laughs> They're losing their crap about it though, and I'm just like, shh. This is normal. <laughs> Everyone has suffered the malicious wasps. <laughs> oh, it is a mess. Moth is also going to just take the time to just think about what he needs to be doing here. Okay, sorry again. You're all good, bro. Hee hee. Oh. Yeah, the... None of my roommates were around, so I had to put away the meat and the vegetables and stuff. Oh. Yeah. Life! Always getting in the way of D&D &D sessions when you're not in person. Yeah, that's for sure. That's yeah. very true. Oh, that's a, yeah, she's gonna have to do that as well, I, I think about it. Oh boy. I would like the sun to stop murdering my eyes right now. My Perfect god. <laughs> Directly in the eyes. That's what I'm suffering through. <laughs> okay. Now the gang's all here now. Oh. Malcolm is reading her letter and thinks about. Her. Oh, what I missed? Who'd she get a letter from? We don't know yet. Oh, cool. She's also doing laundry, which is all a press education. It's stupid. You know, uh, I want the... I really appreciate that, because I think it's... It's really a cheesy of a spell, and also I kind of like doing things the hard way. So. Okay. That's the thing. Even if she did have it, it could be a choice. Yeah, yeah like, I, people... Magic is, magic is used for things that... Magic should be used when there's, no, like, no better option. And yeah. It, it's something to conserve. Mm. It's it's better to uh, do things with your hands. Okay, it is from ah yeah. <laughs> you know, people talk about what spell they would want from D and D. 
Me? I would just want prestidigitation so I wouldn't have to do laundry anymore. That's Me. it. Me. It's like, through, screw fireball, screw transmutation, I just want to be able to do my laundry. Just sit on the couch, wave a hand, boom. That would I'm be cool, going. but you'd still have to do your laundry. Bird laundry. Who has to do laundry? But you also don't need a car then. But but bird laundry. <laughs> yeah, and you'd waste that epic level greater wish <laughs> yeah, to I, do your laundry. I think Sparty Dora wins this one. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take all of the above. Thank you very much. So, anywho, getting off track. Okay, again. so uh, Martha was going to fold that in her pocket, and uh, once all the laundry's done, head out for, for breakfast. Get breakfast in the fun Breakum way. Get in the fun way. <laughs> Don't think about it too hard. I, hmm, okay. What I'm thinking is he catches, he, he, you know, just hunts, up, hunts for mice. Yeah. So. Yeah, sure, we'll go with that one. Yeah. I'm scared. I'm afraid. Like I said, you don't need to know. <laughs> well, I would like it to know so that my brain doesn't assault me it's with ideas. It's a sexual reference, I'm sure. Well, mm -hmm. Dust Cat's it. Is the cat licking the other one? Sure, we'll go with that one. <laughs> listen, listen. This is me slightly getting in the mood of the character. Just a little. Right, so hey, Wind, can you fuck off? God. Who is all at breakfast right now? What? Wait, chickens. actual chickens? <laughs> How did they get out? Okay, fair enough. Hopefully they don't blow away. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah, the only reason... The only th way I like seeing chickens is if it's with a side of mac and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> eh. On a I like my macaroni. Anyway, so who's all at breakfast? But if it's blood sausage, I swear to God. <laughs> it's funny because they're... Okay, it's funny because they're vampires. Sound tasty. What the frick? Making me hungry. What's this red thing? What is this red thing? <sighs> Just. No, nah, not really. Just goes down for breakfast. Don't. Don't laugh at that. <laughs> You're gonna make me freaking cackle. T uh, just who a little there bit. Aside from the party? Or is it just us right now? Dinner?
Alright. Oh, I got Wait, who is the person you said before, Gidge? Charlotte. Oh, I thought you said somebody in between them. Well, oh, who's I, Vola? Just, I guess it's just, uh... Oh, right. So I'm gonna... Uh, I'm of going course. to get Brig. Uh, Walter is going to round up Brig, uh, Saki, and Rezo. You would get Rachel, but Rachel is gone now. So, uh, she's like, so I got this letter from Volo. What can you tell? I probably don't know much about him, but I'm just, I'd like to keep you in the loop. Because, you know, you've walked my back so far, so I trust you. Realize how much that means. But uh, we had a discussion on the boat. Things got a bit, bit, a bit personal, if, I'll be, if I'm being honest. And, uh, Maybe I said more than I should have, but uh, she'll hand the letter over so they can see it. Okay, what's the letter say? Uh, okay. Mana, mana. No. Yes. No. Stop it. Bad. <laughs> I'm going to come over there and bap you on the head. Oh. Kind of political. <laughs> Would you like a sandwich? Oh. Of the lengthy variety. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay! <laughs> he didn't even tell me he was getting a sandwich, but here we are! <laughs> You're following the Sunday tradition, Father! I <laughs> Yeah, same. This is a suffering that I must go through as well, because anytime my friends mention food in another call that I'm in, I always want whatever they had. Yes! Yeah. Interesting. Take that, but eat it. Oh god, she's allergic. <laughs> she just... I'm not sure if I like this. <laughs> Is this a good mouthfeel? Is this a bad mouthfeel? Hmm. It's a new mouth feel. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what to think about this yet. That's all I'm gonna say. Give it time. <laughs> anyway. If you, I could, I recall some of, the, I recall the conversation quite vividly, actually. Like I said, it was rather personal, but I hear no there. How was your, how was your nights? Strange. Saki just shrugs. Hmm. Well, I'm not sure what 
your father has planned, but I want to see if there is a Ambassador uh, Karakai here of the Dwarven Kingdoms. I suppose I should make sure I'm at least made my, my introductions. I've been I've been rather lax in my official duties, but the the hour has come, and I feel the need to return to my post. Not necessarily by my what I want to do, but because I feel it is necessary. Hmm. Quite we've a noble some, policy. We've had a rocky relationship. But late, but it is my duty to ensure that things go as smooth as possible. Surely, you, as a daughter of a noble house, you must have similar duties. Brig, yeah. Understandable. I that was my original. Duty does not end, but I I quite understand the sentiment. Understand it all too well, really. But things are moving beyond me, and I, I I'm part of a greater whole. You still have the luxury of acting like with only yourself in mind. Of course. Saki just shrugs. I ultimately that is his decision, not all. Yeah, Rezo simply nods and gets back up. Good luck re re recovering your lost memories and refinding yourself. Thank you. Martha will grasp both his hands, you know, meaningfully and sincerely. Yeah. Wish them well. No, just this is an opportunity for you, and I hope it goes well. First contact with these things could be helpful. I, but also, sometimes sudden blows to the head can be helpful. So don't try that necessarily. <laughs> That's the extreme measure. Is there is there an ambassador to uh, from the Dwarven Kingdoms here? I may need to speak with them just to announce myself. Huh. That is a shame. Perhaps you should send emissaries out on your own to announce your own presence. Well, I'm sure, if, like, if I perhaps I could write you a letter of introduction, you could send one to Aerostock. Hey, I'm sure we'd love to have. Often grins, very oily. By the way, you guys got a library around?
I cannot remember off the top of my head. Is the silver Pegasus is for now? It is now? <laughs> sure, just go with it. Yeah. So many Pegasi here. The silver key! key. Sir, I'd, I'd like to learn more about the history of your fair city. Or country. Yeah, and I'm, uh... I uh, kind of went to... Oh god, what was the third island called? Okay. What was the other island called? No, where we just came from. Kelvart, there we go. But yeah, I went to Kelvart to find out more about my family, and I wouldn't say I came up empty-handed, but I just raised more questions. So hopefully your library will have some answers. That's where Saki's but, going. On the way, I'd like to uh, wait for the ears of the court. What do you guys have pressure to place? Well, it's not what I expected, I gotta tell you that much. I must say I expect a bit more evening wear. Well, it doesn't look like anyone's trying to eat me, so I... That doesn't surprise me as much. I... Bloodguard made pretty apparent that they're not trying to... You know, they're trying to be a different breed of vampire. But I expect the... Uh, I expect this to bit, they'd be trying a bit harder in some areas. But I don't really I, know exactly what their efforts like, were under like. The top it seems they're doing the right thing. Maybe. I don't know how things went down. Greg, what do you think? Both, I imagine. That's certainly true. Well, if they only conquered them a few years ago, I mean... Man. It's yeah. I that's something I'm a bit more familiar with. It's the uh, move quickly or die. Not that I'm not saying there's anything intrinsically wrong with that. It's actually one of the more interesting things I find about the Rise Society. Keeps you active and on your feet, although it, I find personally it would be... And quite frankly, if I'm going to be a bit bored in my observations here, it seems to be a bit uh, self-sabotaging. The what? The what? The what? Oh. Certainly. Yeah, uh, 
might as well. So this would be daylight. Yep. Hmm. West tents. <coughs> hmm. So if uh, I, I, I'm just wondering, like, yeah, what is making it tent? It, like, is it? Think aloud. Ignore me. Let's go. Building is racist. <laughs> this building is racist. I'm gonna put that on my Discord server so everyone <laughs> can hear that one. Let him know a dwarf said it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I shall. <laughs> Alright, where are the step ladders? <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> yes, Saki would head to the fiction section and look up the... Oh, sorry. Look up the... What do they call it? Yeah. Thank you. Perception. Oh yeah, I can probably close out Rezo's sheet now. That's not Saki. There we go. That'd be 19. Yeah. Does it different in any ways, or is it like not even worth considering? Mm hmm. So, I I feel like that was changed by the cat itself. Cheshire, are you screwing with people again? Okay. He shows her the passage where she's a tiger. Like, look, I know you're striped, but come on. It's 
squints. He so just Ryan, what is the what is the legend as we know it to be? There's a handout. With uh, the no, story. Uh, okay. Basically, long story short, uh Knight tried to do some tried to get in between the Cheshire Cat and the his love, the princess, because he didn't trust the Cheshire Cat and got dragons. Hang on, let me reread this and get it. Yeah, I, 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 I've read the hand and I want Saki's understanding. Oh, he, you want? Yeah. Yeah, basically, uh, since the Cheshire told me this has something to do with my ancestors, I guess maybe I'm related to either the knight or the princess. I mean, apparently, or both, apparently. But yeah, I mean, if they were lovers, then. Yeah, and it's got something to do with the uh, three dragon maidens, and, uh, you know, we just happened to run into three dragon maidens, maidens and. Yeah, but that they're on a different continent. <clears throat> yeah, apparently my family was once nobles there, but, well, uh, nobles fall from grace. And also, the entire continent got sort of, you know, blasted away, and then it seems they recovered, but slowly. It recovered's a strong word. Okay. I already miss Rezo. Alright, so that seventeen. Oh, that's alarming. That is alarm. I don't understand Deadlands enough to make anything. I know they're bad. I know what they do, but I don't know what's causing them. So I know what caused them in the past, the Philosopher's Stone, but why would they be spreading unless... Oh, it's not? I thought it was. Oh, well... Okay. Oh... So, it's a big... it's big and undead, isn't it? We need to stab it. Okay, so th I'm going to follow the under uh, our problem, not right now. Okay, so. Also, we just left there, and I don't really want to take that dirty again, so. All I'm going to say is I've had a fight. I'm okay with it, but. I don't like long voyages on boats. <laughs> I have often wondered that myself. <laughs> Arthur is obviously kidding. As far as we know. As far as we know. <laughs> hmm. Considering that is a she's question. not that live and her tongue doesn't, you know, work like that, it's very likely she is kidding. And she's just playing along. Unless we want a situation like Danny had, I don't think that's a good idea. Oh. Yeah. 
Okay. So, that is insightful. And, uh, oh, also, basically, we really want to get in contact with those cartographers, uh, but at this point, that is a tertiary concern at best. So, uh, I'm going to check out a book on learning a language. I would like to start and try and learn, uh, let's see, Celestial. Learning Ooh. Celestial for Dummies. I learning like Celestial for <laughs> Dummies. Uh, for, 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 ye, for ye old fool. Ye old fool. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Oh my god. That's a thing now. I got a copy. That that's a thing now. See now I wanna <laughs> See right here, these are the things that I would like to make in homebrew right now. Cause I have my little book and I just wanna name a bunch of stupid books like that now. Thanks. <laughs> For dummies. For dummies. <laughs> Jinx! <laughs> no, this is my reading. I got... Well, I don't know. Does the librarian have tights nice, and glasses? But... Sorry. A history book would also be nice, but I'm also going to mostly be learning how to conjugate vowels and celestial, uh, uh, verbs and celestial. She's doing her best. And is there a librarian with long legs, kites, and glasses? Because I'd like to check that out. I'm going to scream. <laughs> yeah, but she's short. <laughs> Walter would have something to say about that, but he's a draft, I fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Also, there's reasons. Yeah. He's, he's an asshole, but... We don't care about those reasons. And now yeah. he flaunts it like a jerk. Mm-hmm. But he's an idiot. Where's that cod piece when Everything you need else it? Everything else because he's a tool. So, no legs. Oh my god. <laughs> No, that was uh, being a dick. Now all I'm thinking of is like munchkin cats. He, he doesn't have to say in front short, of moth. Stumpy he has, legs. Like, he, he, say in front of brick and moth simultaneously. It's like, do you want to get your? Do you want to have both your balls punched at the same time by two different dwarves? Is that what you're into? Hey, he's into kink. Is it that one? That's, that's, like, that's like getting. It's like. Is you getting your testicles slapped with two bricks? Yeah, you know what? I'm a very you do you kind of person. But when it comes to testicular torture, that's where I draw the line. There's yeah, something wrong with you. by insulting by I, <laughs> the, the, all the dwarf jokes. If that's where you draw the line, then I think that your mouth needs to close. <laughs> anyway. Back on track. Dwarf Librarian. Dwarf Librarian. <laughs> Bond of strong drink and industry. Oh, it's just sort of boilerplate dwarf description. It all, I, I was, it, it always ends in fond of strong drink and industry. Hmm. 
Hmm. Human family? Yeah, Mothra did get a book on history, just general history, I... How did... <laughs> uh, so basically, uh, uh, you know, the, the, the general history of what's happened the past uh, 20 years in this area. Good, fuck them. Yeah, these people probably aren't scared of the vampires. They're probably just waiting for the next ruler to show up. Yeah, do you guys remember Futurama? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Where is this going? It's the Slurpy guys. No. Just when she went through that long list of it changing hands, all I could think of was when... The uh, three guys were being lined up to be snoo snooed by the Amazonian women. Oh no. Oh, I was thinking of the slurpy guys who just kept assassinating one another. Oh. <laughs> uh, that's also a good one. But yeah, I was just thinking, and Kiff, as the most attractive, will be snoo snooed by the most attractive Amazonian women. Then the large women. Then the petite women. Then the large women again. Are people hoping she returns, or is that sort of a they ambivalent at this point? What the frick was that? <laughs> that was me making a map noise. No, my dad did something in the other room. You good? Okay. <laughs> Oh, wait, this, that's the, the, those are the True Kingdom supporters. That's right, now I'm remembering. Oh, jeez, uh, just everything, a lot of it just clicked my head. I'm gonna not say what I'm thinking right now. <laughs> no, no, I wasn't thinking about that at all. I was thinking about something completely different, and none of you will know now. Because it's cursed. Well, good, if it's metagame knowledge, I don't want to know it. Well, it's not. It's just me thinking of something completely different that should never have come into existence in my brain. Yes. Like the, like the dentist uh, sink full of teeth. The what? <laughs> the, I, I, no, I would like to go back to that. What? If somebody, if somebody made it like a like a, a, a sink at a dentist office. It looked like sort of it was a bunch of teeth suspended in like resin, and it looked oh. horrifying. Oh my god! Oh, I love that. <laughs> oh. Hmm. 
I just got metagame knowledge too now. Huh? At least I, I think know. I do. Don't tell me. But uh, Mothra is going to have thoughts. <sighs> what kind of thoughts? Oh! Oh, now it's, I'm uh, don't even stupid. need to your Oh! Okay, uh, guys? yeah, I'm definitely. What was not Rezo's telling you now. sword's name? Yeah. So oh, I'm definitely oh. not telling you now because my brain decided to finally work and you would hit me. <sighs> I think I have an idea now. Huh. You think we should tell him? You think, you think we should... Well, they don't know he knows that. Well, okay. Do the others know the name of the sword? You think we should... Yeah. Yeah, yeah Saki yeah. would have... Saki would have been just like, uh... I usually just ignored him whenever he started talking to his sword because I thought he was insane. I, she bought me a drink once. His she sword bought you a drink. A when she wasn't a sword. What? All I can see is Mothram. I can just... I'm imagining yeah, this it's right like a about now. Bird monster. And also being put into a sword kind of, you know, changed you, I bet. I'm imagining like the stupidest thing you right now. Should, God. Do we have an obligation to do something here? Uh, you do realize this could probably start a civil war, right? Maybe, but like I said, do we have an obligation to do something? Library, check out book. Huh? I can still input my my speaking. Yeah, but I can still speak. So, uh... You can't see. silence me, God. Questionable. <laughs> oh. I would've? Oh, wait! That, the white side of the phoenix. Oh, yeah, with that one kid I thought was somehow related to me because he had two tone hair. Things are starting to come together, <laughs> and not in a good way. Woo! Let's go to the library. It'll be such fun. Let's no, learn more about battle. a family here. The other half is All violence. Right. Which is the, let's be honest, is the best part. We all just came, you guys just came to learn some things. That is all. And here we are, having a crisis. <laughs> what stopped? <laughs> Yeah, you know, I don't know if we have the right or the uh, obligation to do anything here. Uh, but I feel like not doing anything is a safe move. No. We already are. Yeah. No, I mean, we're... Okay, so we are is, we have it by association.
Oh, then Resin might also just let it slip and then... Okay, well... I think we will. But... Ooh, this is... I don't even know how to handle this. <laughs> As I said, a crisis. You know what? I need to figure out how, the, how the, I turn this best to... We need to figure out a plan, and uh, the library is not going to tell us that much. <laughs> the library will tell us information, not how to, not what to do with it. <laughs> I'm not saying they're good or bad. It doesn't seem like this. It, okay, white sun, bad. Everybody else, neutral. Because I'm not going, because as far as I'm concerned, this is just sort of, you know, dynasties change, pe people get conquered, things happen. I'm not going to say who's good or bad, because I don't really know the policies. But generally, turning people into swords against their will, bad. That's an understatement. That being said, that also very gracious hosts, and I don't want to get thrown out of my ass and then possibly uh, hammered. Not in the fun way. Not in the fun way. Is this uh, okay. Yeah. 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 Drink. No. That's oh, yes, that's that bad. Praise. No. Stop. Me. Oh, that sounds like a good plan. Oh no. But so did they give you coupons for booze? I didn't get any coupons. <laughs> did you forget to put in sons? Well, yeah. I don't know, because I can't hear it. <laughs> Me. Very good question. Why Modern campaign, so maybe? But, you know, that's the reporter of Slidal of the fifth grade class. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting a theme here. They like silver. Uh -huh. was, this, was this built on a mineral on a silver mine? Oh, I have a history book. I can find it later. Oh, there Lovely. you go. Well, there, there's one reason. At this point, I feel like the name of it is just a werewolf ward. Just like, no, no, no. Don't go in there. Oh. Well, I'm not looking at it right now. Hold on. Oh, God. Here we go again. Oh, no. Here it is. What do you have on tap?
You got Imperial Reserve. How much? I'll take fifty. Fifty. That's a bit much. I'll take. I'll take five. Okay. It's just a matter of you being able to carry it, really. If you took fifty. Okay. Is it the, all right, so is it the same Imperial Reserve as as Bothram is I hoping it is? They must have gotten they must have gotten a new recipe. <laughs> Eh, probably just some rum. Mm. Basic. Yeah, Saki's a bit wary around berries these days, so he'll go after the honey one. She's a dwarf, it'll be fine. She's a pregnant dwarf. <laughs> a pregnant dwarf. I don't think the factor of her being a dwarf counts. I think it does. Dwarf, that's like... It, it's, well, okay, it's yes, but there's a baby. You know what? They probably hand him a tankard shortly after birth, if we're being fair. Yeah. Well, yeah, for the pain, but that's after the baby is out. No, no they're saying they hand the baby a tankard. Yeah, you, no! can, you, can, you can put a giant nipple over the tankard. Stop <laughs> that! <laughs> yeah! This is canon. <laughs> That's bad! No! No, it, 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 mm. dwarves don't have to... Yeah, they, they might get drunk, but there's no fetal alcohol syndrome for dwarves. Are you sure? If they did, then uh, that it, if if they I'm did, then uh, dwarves would be you know like have a very high mortality rate. I have concerns still. Okay. Just don't ask Martha about childcare. Don't if you if. Yeah, I don't think that that would be a very good idea. Sven simply scratches his chin as he tries to size up the new people. Sense motive, perception. Sense your motive. Call. Determine the trustworthiness of a target. Eh, fair enough. Ooh, that's a good roll. How trustworthy? Well, that begs the question. I guess how trustworthy yeah, is Mark? That's a 31 altogether. Oh, lovely. Yeah, he kind of glares suspiciously at them before re returning to his drink. What's your problem, buddy? <laughs> he just looks over at Mothram. No problem. Just enjoying drink. You don't look like you're very enjoying it. He just turns back to his drink. 
fine. I don't want to talk to you anyway. He flips her off. Evil eye. This is going to be very interesting. This is going to be very interesting. <laughs> Minus two on saves. Oh no. Oh wait, that means he can get drunk easier. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he would probably have a soft drink right now. <laughs> Prepare for burps. <laughs> no, that's it. Just <laughs> say what? Sure, why not? Milk. I right. know. Welcome to Cat you Town. You have to do a prop. What is it? I don't speak with vampire supporters. Why not? Because they support the vampires. Well, okay, so... I... What is... No, that's technically it's not racist, it's political, because it's not, he doesn't have a problem with vampires specifically, it's that he has a problem with the polity here, which is a valid complaint. He may have his own, own concerns, which have nothing to do with the fact that they're vampires, and more the fact that they're conquerors. No, it's because they're vampires. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for clearing that up. Your frankness is refreshing. So, uh, can I help you with thing? No, you 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 clarified yourself. That was all. I thank you. Also returns to her drink. <laughs> yeah, he's literally just sitting there waiting for Charlie. He wants nothing to do with them right now. Especially if he... Mostly because he can smell vampires on them. Mothram doesn't consider herself part of the vampire establishment, so it doesn't take any offense at his rude behavior. But she... And, and, she, and, and uh, he answered her question, so it's like, okay, done. I think things are getting a lot stickier, and uh, I'm not sure exactly how to handle this. And I think the best thing I can do right now is to uh, politely not stick my nose in it, which is going to be hard for me. One of my favorite lines is, let me through, I'm nosy. <laughs> so, yes, <laughs> this is going to be a challenge. I don't think I, I, I don't know what we should do because I don't know who it would help and who it would harm to do any uh, to you know make any statements or stands. Therefore, it's sort of I don't want to make a mistake here and upset the apple cart. So caution is the best way to handle this and. Uh, Play, yeah, keep our cards close to our chest, play it by ear, and don't do anything that we can't take back. Until we have more information on what it, I... Uh, Us for what we know, although you know that was publicly available information. So it's not like we, you know, raided a, a vault for it.
the icon. I sent it to you in DMs, so. Didn't fly. <laughs> Where is my son? <laughs> This is also a placeholder icon because I need to actually get one done properly for the campaign at hand. Because I have a cute idea for his little outfit. That's fun. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Felt there's also felt that this stuff is Imperial Reserves. That kind of I don't know how that affects the saves because like you were the this stuff does right. It's plus two to all saves for an hour. That's why both was like one gold for this. Yes, please. Oh no. <laughs> yes, Sven immediately just kicks off the stool and runs outside. Yeah. Well, I'm That's curious. <laughs> Let me flip a coin to see what's going on. I'm kidding. <laughs> Could be a number of things. Don't know, still can't hear it. Yeah, it really is.
course. Great. Yeah. Lovely. Freaking great. Okay, I will say that shirt that he is wearing is not the current clothing. He actually has, like, some kind of basic, kind of stained-ish shirt and suspenders on. Because we don't have a good thing for that yet. <laughs> Lovely! Okay. Nope. <laughs> No. They're all... Yeah. Uh, okay. 14. Lovely. Jewish Wookiee. Yeah, yeah, we uh, just have to have the characters in the order, that is all. Wait, actually, I can't put it in myself. Weird. Well, give him... Oh, I don't have control of Sven, either. That's probably why. That, yeah, that'd, that'd do it. Uh huh? Because you didn't give it to me? Well, you can just uh, right click on the token. There we go. Yeah, but that doesn't help me control his token. Oh, there it goes. Uh, no, I got Saki. Yeah, right click on the, on Sven's token and see if I'm not able to, no, wait, I, if I can move him, I don't know why it's not letting me. Yeah, why don't you delete them and then put them back on? That should fix the problem. In theory. There we go. By the way, do you... Do you just drag and drop onto the initiative order? The tokens, I mean? Oh, okay. Because I couldn't figure out how to do that for my players. You know, I have to put them in all in manually. Oh, great. Oh, damn. Lovely. Fourteen. <laughs> You're trying your best. Okay. <laughs> so hate the, which I don't get. Okay, it's like a thing that it's just like most gay people can't do math, drive a car, and there's something else. I see to remember the big famous gay mathematician. Which <laughs> is weird. Well, okay, but it's like it's a funny thing that it's just like a lot of people do that and it's just like okay, fair enough, but there are some of them. 
Oh yeah, cooking was the other one. You can't have all three. Rainbow truckers are a thing. Well, no, it's just like it's a thing of you can't have all three yeah, yeah, of them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a very funny hee hee. Just like I'm Italian, I talk with my hands, I'm short tempered, and love pasta dishes. There you can have all three. Okay. Uh, hang on, let me remember how this works again real quick. Okay, I'm gonna start my bardic performance. Pretty sure that takes a... Yeah, that takes standard action. Everybody... Oh wait, I need to make a knowledge check on these guys first. They're undead, so that's knowledge religion, right? Yep. Okay, so that's 14. Uh, let's move the hell out of my way. So that's a 30, and if these things are CR 30, I quit. Okay, so anyway, I successfully identified them with a knowledge skill. So everybody has a plus one insight bonus to AC, attack rolls, and saving throws against these guys. What, what instrument are you playing? A plus two, actually. Oratory. Oratory? Uh, what is that? Or... No, oratory is basically, you know... Uh, okay, you're giving a speech. Oh, okay, I see. Basically, this skill represents... Identifying their weaknesses and pointing them out to you guys. Yeah, yeah, I was just asking the part performance in and of itself. Oh, right. But yeah, instruments wouldn't really make sense for this guy. <laughs> Thank you. So you yeah, that? Just, you just start just babbling off, spreading off information. Yeah, remember that scene in Men in Black? Go for the mosh tendrils! Yeah, yeah. He's a Volchanian! <laughs> Okay. Yeah, that's my standard, so... Yeah, he would also pull out a whip and a silver blade. And, uh... Yep, we're good. Charges and attacks. I cannot wait till I get that feat that lets me full attack at the end spend. of a charge. Oh, I did. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Wrong cat! I have too many cat folk, okay? Well, it's a it problem. Two and a half, yeah. Okay, so... It's... God, I cannot remember his stats. So yeah, that's a... 26 to hit, holy crap. And what are your sneak attack dice? Three. Ooh. Yeah, I charge and I get my sneak attack dice. So that's 17 damage altogether, along with uh, a three electric damage. Oh wait, with a check like that, Sven would have been able to tell him that they're vulnerable to fire, right? Or are they vulnerable to fire? Okay, can I... Yeah, so three fire... Acid. Yeah, these things... Yeah. Yeah. Yep. 
Also, how do you shuffle the turn order like that? Uh, the button that says the like ascending beef ascending. Uh. Oh, okay. Yeah, fortunately for me, my players are very patient, so they don't mind that I have no clue what I'm doing. You're huh. trying. You'll figure it out. It's good. Very good choice. That's not how you roll it. Nope. Well, I didn't hit anybody at this level. Yeah, geez, even wizards would dodge that one. Yeah, yeah that's fair. Yeah, three is just, you know, not hitting. Do not want. <laughs> Good thing I put some stuff into Escape Artist. Thirteen. day. No, thank you. I would like to not be. <laughs> that was a nat 20. <laughs> you are no longer grapple. <laughs> <laughs> Escape artist. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> just zoop, dropping down, 
later. <laughs> zip zap, zip and pop. Indeed. I'm going to attack it because that was a dick move. That's not too good. Fourteen? Mm. Dang, unfortunate. Swing and a miss on that leg, probably. Because <laughs> basically, what I'm imagining is just drop down. It's like later. <laughs> okay. Huh, that's funky. I don't have a BAB. I should, yes. Why is that not there? What class are you? Uh, rogue. I chose I chose another rogue just to keep like Yeah, your the... bab is three. Keep the parties. Yeah, yeah keep the party aligned right. I'm gonna... Yeah, your bab should be three then. I'm gonna fix that. Pop that three in there. Actually, wait, no. Okay, if I did put that in there though. I should, would that make, would that have made a difference though is the question because then it would be six to add so that would be a 17 yeah because that, that yeah that would be a 17 actually dang unfortunate Ugh. and I can't do the fun thing to knock him off guard yet unfortunately <sighs> since we're already in here Bothra will cast major armor and earth will hulk out where is Urus? yeah could you never do that again <laughs> Where, where, where is a wrist <laughs> on the uh, page here? There he is. <laughs> he wasn't there a second ago. Yes, he is. And he should have been here a minute ago. <laughs> no. <laughs> I will sass you however I please. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna pull out, I'm gonna cast a uh, Beguiling Gift. If he fails a DC 17 will save, then he must accept the object I'm offering him and drink it. I hope it's acid. I hope it's acid too. No, that would be an obviously damaging thing and wouldn't work. Oh, acid, oh. Can be, acid can look like water. I mean, sulfuric acid is clear. Yeah, it is. Well, regardless, DC 17 will save, if you please. <sighs> Fuck. Well, this is going to be far less fun. Yeah, he... Looks at the object and can immediately tell it's holy water. Mm. I'm just like, ew, yuck. Mm. <laughs> well, I tried. There was an attempt that was, that was made. That was far less fun than I was hoping. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. These things happen. Yeah. Oh well. Okay, he's just gonna full attack this guy. Hey, yeah, do you have your vampire anti vampire necklace? They would have given it back. Aha! Oh, oh no. I have a vampire be gone necklace then. What does that do again? 
It makes them hiss and back away from you. I rolled a 20 and a 21 for Saki's attacks. Well, he wasn't expecting vampires, so it really wouldn't make sense for him to have it anywhere except in his pocket. Yeah, so he'd probably just whip it out and, like, present it to them, be <laughs> just like, hey, hey, Perfect. don't! Yeah. A 20 and a 21. Ugh. Ugh. Gorilla. Yeah, screw the vampire be gone necklace. I need a necklace of mighty fist so I can bring my bab up some. Or attack bonus up some. Oh yeah, that's uh that was a full attack, so that was my round. Oh, wait a minute, I forgot. Saki's wearing his claw blades. Does a 21 and a 22 hit? Yeah, I totally forgot. Those are masterwork. I haven't worked out a way to factor that in into Hero Lab yet, but... It, you know what I'm saying. Seriously. <laughs> I rolled a 1 for damage. Okay, I rolled higher on a d3. <laughs> That's a total of six damage. Nice. Hooray! I'll take it. Hell yeah. It is... Oh, that's flat foot. 20. Yeah, he does. He actually take. The... Oh, I see. He gets into a thumb war. Up. Here, it. drink this. You'll feel better. He gets into a thumb war with himself and loses. Uh huh? No. <sighs> Yay! So he takes two d four damage. Uh, well, I never. It's generic. Yeah. But yeah, that's five damage. 
This is just, you know... Angie. Blee! What's the spell? Oh, that's just a touch attack, or a ranged attack, which, since he's right up in my grill, that provokes quite an attack of opportunity. Uh, yeah, but it, it's a ranged touch attack, though, so it's... Uh, never mind, either way, that's a natural 19, so... So, 28, yeah, he, uh, he hit. Nine damage. Oh, it isn't to damage, it's just attack rolls. Yeah, and it's against my touch AC. But since it's a ranged attack, it's based off his dexterity plus his bab. Four, that's 13, which, uh... I'm not sure, where the hell's my armor class? Hello? Okay, and no, it's 18. He's a bouncy kid. Play jump rope with the deadly laser beam. <sighs> Lovely. I can still get an attack of opportunity, though. He is. He is really right up in my... <laughs> 21. Ah! Singular.
It's some good stuff. Each ray only deals like two something a damage. Or, or four. Yeah. And at this level, I... you probably only get one ray. Wait. Being set on fire seldom is. Yeah, it really isn't. It's not very fun. Okay. Oh, that one's bad. That one's definitely not. Actually, neither of these are. Hmm. Would a 22 hit? Ah! Thank god, at least one of them hit. Meter exceed. <laughs> Alright, so one hit. That's good. That is four. Four damage. Oh, it does? Oh. Oh yeah, I'm so, I'm so bad at these things. So there would be seven. Okay, Mothram is going to uh Give this one, right beside her, the evil eye, targeting his AC. Uh, yeah. Uh, it... Yeah, he's screwed. And Eris is going to uh, introduce the him to the flail and teeth. Okay. Oh, wait, the 16, is that with minus 2 on top of it? Okay. Okay, gotcha. Hey, guys, you are factoring in Sven's plus 2 buff, right? I'm not on that, so that'd be 8. It's still, it's still, too, it's still too, uh, a little low. Wait, wait okay. What is, what is the buff the, 2 the again? One point, so it's still, it's still just shy. What is Attack the buff rolls, to AC again? and saves. Oh, okay. Tackles. But he still got wands on the head to play, also. Alright, Sven has had enough of this guy's shit and he just attacks. By the way, I called my silver short sword the bastard killer. <laughs> and that's 24. 
and five damage. Oh, damn it. I forgot a I forgot a thing. Never mind. Too late now. Carry on. I'll take it. Yeah, I'm uh, gonna keep clawing this bastard. That's a 22... Ooh, and uh, 29. <laughs> 17 damage. Dead er. <laughs> There's a big difference between mostly dead and all dead. Do you want dead even get I don't like undead get unconscious. They just drop. Like a sack of potatoes. No, he does not. Uh, no, they've just been trying to grapple. Oh, wait. She got lit on fire. Yeah, Charlie got lit on fire. Yeah, she meaning Natalie. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, don't you dare, you sack of shit. Saki literally says that. A protective kitty. And attack of opportunity. <laughs> That's a 19, and my short sword threatens on 19. Nice. Because that threatens on a 19 to 20, like a long sword. Yeah, swords have high crit ranges, but they don't have high crit multipliers. Yeah, axes only crit on a nat 20, but. They deal triple damage. But well, you can get a keen axe, so... And scythes, let's not talk about scythes. Axes crit on a nat 20? <laughs> does the... Does that include mine? My, my small axes? Good. Good. Okay, so... Altogether, that's 10 damage. 20 if silver doubles that uh, again. Ooh. No. None of that. Shame on you. Uh, 
How about you don't? None of that. Shame None on of you. that. <laughs> Very bad. bad. Very bad. Bad. Don't carry away the child. That's illegal. That's called kidnapping. Also, they're looking kind of rapey. <laughs> oh, who's my gonna year affect the Nazis? Me. He is a one year away from 18, but still. <laughs> he's a, he's almost an adult. I, 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 honestly, I don't think they're vampires. They're not going to rape. They're just going to you know, drain him like a freaking uh, Capri Sun pack. Like a Capri Sun, yeah. Like a grape. <laughs> no, I want Capri Sun. Thanks, guys. Anytime. <laughs> what did you say, Mav? Is it on the preserve? It is well. My CMB. Nope, it does not. <laughs> Yay. Just later. Nope. Nope. <laughs> I have these skills. I can do that. Get off. <laughs> This round, what attack of opportunity would I have provoked? Or would be provoked? Yeah, I was just like, excuse you, I didn't make any this round. Okay, let's see what happens. Mmm. You said that was a plus two? With Sven's thing? Yeah. So that's 19. And I don't feel like that would hit. Ugh! Unfortunate. He just Sven... slips his axes away at that point and pops back down off the cart. Yeah, Sven hurries over. You okay? You okay? I'm fine. Don't get your knickers in a twist. God. Uh, that's gratitude for you. <sighs> I'm Look, fine. Uh... Just don't worry. Yeah, he turns back to the rest of the party. Look, uh, sorry uh, we got off on the wrong foot. Thanks for the save. You make new friends while I was away. Uh, people I don't want to kill. That's a start. <laughs> Alright, it's posted Mothman reaction in the chat. <laughs> oh boy. Sven turns to the rest of you. This is Charlie. I am Sven. Sven knows much. Tells some. Sven knows things others do not. <laughs> yes, I based him off my Eek the Liar. I love that. That's very good content Mother, right Mother, there. Mother, how do you do? So, what brings you to Vampire Capital? I'm here to follow up on some leads. Uh, about why some th something was stolen from my family, my people, and I'm trying to figure out how it was stolen. 
it's uh, it's not something that can be quite so easily returned, but I can at least find the culprit and bring them to justice. Well, I am information broker by trade. My prices are very fair as well. Hmm. What can you tell me of, uh... Well, that can, uh, that can wait for another time. So the immediate... Right now, what the, what's all this about? Well, I have theory that Bloodguard isn't as... You know, kind and benevolent as they try saying. And, uh... Well, looks like Charlie may have found something. Oh, yes, most definitely. Interesting. So what have we found out? Found a location. Oh. Did I call it or did I call it? You called it, you called it, I know. Blood farm. Oh. Yes. Ooh. It wasn't very pleasant to see. Yes, vampires like to pretend well they are good. Blood farms are. Yeah, vampires like to pretend they're good, but they can never not dominate mortal. Ugh. Arthur, like, gets a sort of glassy-eyed look at her eye for a moment. I have experience, I have experience with vampires and blood farms. Then you know best vampire's dead one, he says as he kicks this one. <laughs> Can I make another religion check? Because these don't look like regular vampires. So well, it looks like our dear Bloodsong Emperor has secrets he wants to keep. I suppose so. Secrets that do not stay hidden from Sven. Actually, sure, at this point, sure Charlie would, would probably start car. kicking the body behind him. Uh, Moth is going to start decapitating one. <laughs> well, go ahead. He's just going for the pockets to see what he might be able to find. <laughs> Heads well, are important to show that it's important to show your work. That's what heads are for. Yes. <laughs> well, what say you to helping me investigate Blood Farm? Because either they are associated with Blood Song Emperor and needs to be brought to light, or they are rogue faction within Bloodguard and need still need to be brought to light. Either seventeen way, on my perception. There are, there are other possibilities as well, but I agree. It needs to be investigated one way or the other. Quite. Care to come along? I could use some help. Of course. That was a 17 on my perception, by the way. Okay. Yeah, yeah probably. Yeah. <laughs> Just, just to make sure that there's nothing that was missed that might be on them. Oh my god, I can hear an ice cream truck. Already? Uh. That's a funky well, tune they're playing. Uh, what's up with... Who are you? Mothra points to Charlie. Oh, he was with me. Don't worry about him. Charlie Libet, pleasure to meet you. Sure. Thanks for the uh, help there. Mmm, <laughs> lovely. All right. He what would bring those. He would bring those back. There's several vials of things plus vampire fangs. We got elf blood, 
unholy water and violet violet blood. It Sven immediately snatches the bottle of unholy water and smashes it on the ground. There are five of them. <laughs> Both of his eyes are going Rinse to... and repeat. <laughs> Both of is going to uh may I see that, the violet and blood. Yeah, and he would hand over the couple of vials there. I don't think we need to let them know about this just quite anybody know about this just quite yet. And also mm. before Sven breaks the last vial, can he make a detect magic or a knowledge check to identify who made it? The unholy water. Uh yeah. which am I doing? Okay. No, you don't roll two d20s. Charlie would actually take the vampire fangs and slip them in his pocket for now. That's not you. <laughs> okay, that's you have You have two cats with S as the start of their name with four letters. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, wait. No, never mind. I'm stupid. <laughs> Listen, I'm dumb. I'm forgetting things. Also, I'm still not sure where Alduin's from, but as we established, he's half a cat. Yeah, well, that's neither here nor there. We're he he was he was we'll figure it out. He's from, around, he's from around, and he doesn't want to talk any more about it. Right, but anyway, I got a thirty-five for my religion check. Believe it or not, this guy can outdo Rezo in knowledge. Love that. Also. Turns out cat folk bards can get a bonus to their bardic knowledge as a favored class option. Me? Oh. Pickishness. Isn't that really like a prerequisite for an evil entity? Not necessarily. Especially if it's being worshipped. No. And spiders. <laughs> Oh, so they're the god of fuck that. <laughs> 35. 35. I rolled a 19. Nice. Hey. He points to Brig. Uh, excuse me, uh, dwarf priest lady. Dwarf fucking priest lady. All you are accurate descriptions. <laughs> you are uh, familiar with pantheons, yes? Any chance you would be familiar with Drow Pantheon? Uh, what? Wait, cool, Brig. Uh, what can you tell me of Velkuna?
so he is dead. Out of character, what did I just say? Wait, what? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You could say Guess other who... people got the dicks. You did Guess it again. Guess who knows under common? Hee <laughs> <laughs> hee. Yes, we went over this. <laughs> yeah. Sven is an even bigger nerd than Rezo, I told you. Okay. When when we were going over Charlie, I asked you what are the most important languages, and you said abyssal and undercommon, and I applied them. Yes. <laughs> That'd be uh, a uh... geography. I'd say knowledge local, because geography is about, you know, you, it could be either way. Okay. Uh, oh! This would be another case where knowledge culture would be helpful. 29. Holy crap, you out-knowledged Sven. I got a 28. <laughs> he knows, he has picked up things. He <laughs> he. <laughs> well, Mothram's pretty pale, too, so. Although she's been... I mean, Martha looks like she, Martha looks dwarfy. She just, you know, doesn't. She looks like she's you know, only got. She it looks like she's gotten several sunburns the past month or so. Yeah, that's Sven when he realizes the craft of her armor. <laughs> <laughs> he and Martha are getting along just fine. Why is Dwarf wearing drow things? That's a good question. Yes, because drow are slavers. I have a thing against people who enslave others. What a coincidence! Oh goodness. Seems he did make a friend. Gosh. Yeah, he turns to Mothra. <sighs> you know, normally I don't like dwarves, but for you, I make exception. <laughs> no, no, dwarves. How do you put it? Uh, We're hard to get along with. Well, dwarves are they always so serious about their beards. So many beards. Sven thinks they just wish they had glorious manes like catfolk. You know, I I wouldn't be surprised. Honestly, I, I'm quite fond of my hair, and uh, some women can grow beards, but I can't. So whatever. I'm not gonna. He just shrugs and turns back to Brig. So, are we going to have a problem? Sven steps in front of her. Are we? She's cool, usually. Okay, then we cool then. Yes, Sven just shrugs and doesn't seems to have completely dropped this issue. <laughs> that was fast. That was very fast. 
You just trying to dwell on bullshit, Sven. <laughs> no, he just completely dropped it. So, what did say you to raiding Blood Farm? How far is it? How far? Uh, is it? How far would it be? <laughs> Quarter day. Sure. Let's do it. Although, do we need to repair your wagon? Uh, well, it wasn't really mine. <laughs> well, do we need to get? Do we need to get out of here quickly before the owner comes knocking? Uh, fair enough. <laughs> Unless it was the slavers, or unless it was the blood farms, in which case it doesn't matter. <gasps> Actually, wait, question. Was it the blood farms, though? Dang, all right. Okay. <laughs> Lovely. Okay. That was so Lady that, Annabelle's that is... carriage. That was Lady Annabelle's carriage. Yeah. I was gonna steal it. <laughs> you know what? It was the vampire's fault that destroyed it. You just moved it, so. Yeah. But we really should be moving. For people. Yes. Ben yes. drags. Very much. Ben drags the dead vampire next to it. <laughs> now it's somebody <laughs> else's problem. <laughs> A keep on going what? Oh. Well, I could eat All some right. dinner, but I can just grab a snack if other people want to keep going. Yeah, I don't keep care going. either way. Yeah, just give me a minute to grab a snack and I'll be right back then. Yeah, we can we can make a quick break. Kay. Sweet. Okay. Right. Sounds good.
Hello. Hello. I might actually have to uh, suggest uh, stopping because I'm starting to really sleepy. Oh. Uh, I don't know. I, I, yeah, I might have to. Well, I guess we gotta wait for Shay to come back then. Yeah. But if you need to, that's fine. Yeah, I, I, I've been up for a while. Uh. And, uh, my sleep schedule's been off because uh, I was in quarantine and yeah, I was really off. And we we got a shelter in place ordered now too, and the days are gonna blur one together. Mm. So, so excuse me. You are excused. He. <laughs> <laughs> What is that? No idea. Hmm. 
Oh boy. I may actually have to suggest we stop here because I'm getting very I uh I I didn't sleep enough last night and uh I got up early. So not yet. <laughs> Maybe you guys should both take big old naps when we leave. No, take another one. Food good for Matt. <laughs> yeah, I was just saying, I may have to uh, bow out because I'm getting really sleepy. Okay. Tough. Stuff. Right. Yeah. So, uh, dust? I know it was only one one battle, but uh, Bard, good. Huh? Oh yeah, yeah, he did pretty well. Uh, I like the funny Bard. The thing is, he he did well, and uh, I'm after yesterday as well. I watched those session. I'm starting to change my opinion of Bard. They're not amazing, but they're, you know, not Useful. as trash as I su suspected them to be. Good. Heck yeah. Yeah, it's just, I've seen a lot of trashy ones. Yeah, I, w I was telling Shay when I was making them, like, I couldn't just min-max a Bard and call it, you know, a good Bard. I actually had to have a story behind them, too. Yeah. So it's like, I wouldn't call it a success unless it was like an actual fleshed out character. Uh, I hope mm. all bars kind of do 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 be min max. Otherwise, they're just kind of. Mm. Well, I didn't min max him, and he's doing decently. It's not min max. That's not min max. That's the wrong word. Optimize. Compromise. What do you. Optimize. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. But basically, I go on, you have a plan, you go in for the, with the plan, and you actually set it to accomplish something rather than, you know, I'll do whatever. It would have been so much funnier if that, you know, spell would have worked where I tried to make them drink the... Hilarious. <laughs> that would have been lovely. Very, very yeah, funny. but it would have been funnier. <laughs> but oh well. Yeah, no biggie. You're Besides, fine. now I can eat and go back to Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'll right. get the uh picture to you as soon as possible I'll probably start working on that once we're off of call here so that'll be to you as soon as it's done
All right. Yeah, just, Later. you know, text me. Yeah. All right. All right. Later, everybody.